Hey, this is Rick with Shooter1721. <laughs> Look what we got here from Airgun Technology, the Uragon Synthetic. Thank you so much, Joe Broncado from Top Gun Air Guns. Thank you, man. That was awesome of you to send it. Oh, you're wondering what optics we got on top? This is the Hawk 6 to 24 Compact. I think this was the right choice, Joe. Thank you for sending the scope and the gun for review. We really appreciate it. Let's go over a couple features of the gun. Of course, you can see we got our pick rail on top. We got a pick rail underneath for your uh, bipod. You got 533, 530 cc tank. Whoo! And you have the length of the guns about well, it is 32 and a half inches. And then the weight is 7.9 pounds. It comes with two 12 shot mags. And uh, it comes, it's a fill probe. So right here is where you fill, right here is where your fill probe goes. And we'll, of course, we'll show you that. But overall, this thing is built like a tank. You, when you put this in your hand, you're just like, wow. And another thing that is really awesome about it, one thing I noticed when you put it up for offhand shooting, you could be offhand shooting with this because just the way it stays there, it is incredible. But you know what? That's enough talking about this gun. Let's get to that bench and shoot this gun. Okay, here we are at the bench and we're gonna take some uh, shots down there. But let me tell you what we're using, FX 18.1 grain. And uh, we're at about 60 yards. And uh, let's see what the five shot group, see how this guy can do here. I think we're all on. Get situated here. All right. Okay. I'm just waiting for the wind on that fifth shot. Yeah. Yep. That is really nice and tight. Looks like we got four in the same hole, and we got one just a little bit outside of there. Those four are real tight. So you're looking probably... This thing's a tank driver. I think you're looking at, uh, oh, it's definitely under a half inch. So it's probably three eighths. I think the gun shoots, I mean, that's really good for 60 yards, 22 cal. That looks really good. That's impressive. Ryan, that's, that's a tack driver. Wow. Just taking a look down there. All right, let's see what else we can get into. Okay, well, we're going to give it a trigger pull. That's one of the things about the Uragon that I really like is I love the trigger. And that's one thing you'll notice if you uh, do purchase one of these. And the trigger is so nice on this. And I, I'm curious to see what it is. We're going to take a see what we get here. 8.5. Okay, well, that's, that's actually really nice. It's just clean. Everything about this gun is like really clean. It's impressive. There's a lot of guys that are on uh, Facebook, Instagram constantly sending me messages, talking and things like this. And there's a, there's a group of them that have these and they're like, Rick, you got to get one for review. And I just want to thank Joe Broncado for, you know, taking the time and send this for us for review. And that is really cool. But I see what these guys are saying. What a clean, well-built gun. All right. Ooh, 8.6. What? Come on. Come on. All right. Okay, 11.4. So basically, we're probably looking at about, you're looking at maybe about a 9-ounce pool, somewhere around there, but 9 ounces. I mean, that's, that's super clean there. Yeah, everything's cold. When we do these videos, you know, I know you guys probably can't even see my face. The sun is shining like right on me. But uh, when we do these videos and stuff in the cold, we're starting to see things, how the guns perform in the summer and then in, in the winter. 
there's a difference in feet per second. So just remember that we actually shot this when it was warmer earlier in the week, shooting about nine, somewhere around 915. Today, we saw it just shooting at about uh, 884 to 888. It's just because of the way it is uh, temperature wise. So just remember that when you're shooting PCP and you're seeing your numbers change up, you know, that's something that you can do with your chronograph and keep your numbers in the winter and keep them in the summer. All right, let's get to some final thoughts. Well, here we are at the end of the video of the 22 cal Uragon. Oh my goodness. What a, what a gun, what an air gun. And uh, talk a little bit about the optics I have on top here. We have the six to 24 Hawk uh, compact, perfect little scope for this gun. I mean, perfect. I was really impressed. We got this from uh, Joe Brancato also. He sent this uh, scope and the gun for a review and I'll tell you what he says you're gonna like this and I was like all right you know check it out you know and um, and I'll tell you what the clarity was beautiful so I just want to talk a little bit about that that was the optics because guys always say well what, what scope were you running and uh, I, I really like this side focus it was very nice now let's talk about the overall performance so we know that uh, we saw some chronograph numbers about 888, and I had mentioned earlier they were shooting 920. It was. And then we sat down here today, and we're sitting here, and it's a lot colder than it was the day that I chronographed it up there. So we are seeing a drop in numbers uh, from, I think it was 9, 915 to 910, somewhere around there, to 888 today because the temperature is a lot colder, and we're seeing that happen. So I wanted to mention that. But the accuracy you saw from the gun, the trigger, that's on the gun and the way if you're a guy that likes to shoot offhand the way this gun comes up and then stays when you're up shooting offhand it's just it's awesome I mean it's balanced so well uh, I talked with a lot of the guys online they're like this thing's built like a tank well guys I have to agree with you uh, great job with this air gun I think this is a uh, uh, air gun technologies I think this is just a an awesome air gun and uh, I look forward to uh, reviewing the 30 cal I think that's a, the next one that we're gonna see but this 22 is just clean shooting plenty of shots oh my goodness overall super impressed with this this is Rick with shooter 1721 thanks for watching